Yo. What up? All right. Um, so, uh, we got another one from Family Guy. Hmm. Okay. Family Guy. Yes. What we got? This is another try not to laugh. All right. Well, let's try. Okay. What? No, no. I got, I got you an awesome gift. But you can't see it until tonight. Tonight? What, why tonight? Oh, you'll see. Tonight is going to be amazing. You're going to smile bigger than I did when I was on the cover of Mad Magazine. <laughs> you kids don't remember Mad or magazines. Fortunately, I'm on broadcast television. What, me worry? Okay, me worried. I like the blue truck. Thanks. It was supposed to be a fire engine, but I couldn't find the red glitter pen. Well, that's our long-form tax return done. I could be wrong, but I think we're getting a million dollars back. Ryan, quick, check out your six o'clock or, or your nine o'clock. I can't tell time. A perfectly good mini-fridge. Well, you're gonna have to fight Danny DeVito for it. Would you look at that? A perfectly good, normal-sized fridge. You know what? If this works, I'm going to put it in my room. This is gonna be fun, Stewie. Yeah, I'm pumped. Partying's in our blood. We even had ancestors at the Boston Tea Party. All right, let's stick it to the British and throw this tea overboard. How about this Earl Grey? Okay, you know what? Let's keep the Earl Grey. We, we all have to have breakfast, right? Think whatever you want, Brian, but I'm taking this before Danny DeVito gets it. That's all right, kid. I don't need it anymore. Danny DeVito got bit by a magic mosquito. Danny DeVito and the magic <laughs> mosquito now streaming on Peacock. I'm hearing a lot of buzz. Here goes the chamomile. Uh, no, 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 you throw that out, you're throwing my good night's sleep away. How about this throat coat with echinacea? Okay, you guys are gonna hate me, but we're coming up on cold and flu season, and I just think that would be irresponsible. Well, what about- You know what, let's just boil some water and write him a strongly worded letter. There he is, here comes the groom! Please, even you guys know it's my anniversary? How is that possible? It's easy, I follow your wife. You mean on Instagram? Yep. Are you here for shoes? Yeah, but I'm not sure what size I am. The sizing line's right over there. Just put your bare foot on my stomach and I can tell you your shoe size. What the hell? I don't know. Next. A little higher. I don't know. Next. <laughs> That'll do, pig. That'll do. Check it out, Rupert. Juice box. Boom. go -Guts. Yup. And most importantly, for freshness, an open box of oh, Army shit. Hammer's baking powder. Now with 40% more fingers. Pretty much all he had to do was not eat people. Huh. Convenient, I guess. Can's not so cold, though. Yeah, everything in there is either lukewarm or frozen solid. Dang, no more sush for Meg for nine whole months. That's honestly what you're taking away from all this? Well, yeah. I'm still getting sush. Who needs a fancy restaurant when you could be wet and kind of dizzy? Oh, Peter, it's just perfect. Well, except for that cruise ship that still can't dock because of COVID. Is the election over yet? We are all pooping in the sink. I'm from <laughs> Iowa, so I still think this is awesome. Uh. Papa John, I'm sorry to bother you, but my pregnant uh. daughter asked that I bring her the worst pizza ever, and yours is that. You think we're worse than Lunchables? Yes. 7-Eleven? Look, my friend, my friend, my friend. It's uh, late. Lunchables. We've done our research. <laughs> I'm gonna grab a real quick hot chocolate. Warm up my bones. <laughs> the sauce, the bread, the toppings, the way it's cooked, the people cooking it, the way it tastes like the box it comes in, it's really, really the worst. I mean, you even make butter dipping sauce terrible. Well, do you want the butter sauce with the pizza or not? Yeah, no, give me a bunch of everything. <laughs> oh, perfect. Is dolphin favorite? <laughs> All right, sush time for Meg. I know you want some hospital sush. No? Dad, sush? Pepsi Max? Ma? Diet Max? Sush? Chris? Max? Code Red? Sush? No? Well, I'm getting some sush and a Max. I'll be at the cafeteria. <laughs> Don't get the sush, guys. Oh, I've solved bigger problems than this. Like when I forgot the safe word at that sex party. Aardvark! Ah! Aardwolf! Abacus! Ah! Abandoned! Ah! Abase! Ah! Abate! No! Abattoir! Ah! The good news was I had memorized the entire dictionary when I got bored over COVID. The bad news was the safe word was Ziziva, a genus of South American weevils, which coincidentally I was forced to keister. 
<laughs> yeah, yeah, it's hard to laugh without fatting. Feels like you and me are on the same page about a lot of stuff. We work well together, like the employees at TJ Maxx. Hey, where should I put these? Just throw them on the floor and step on them. That's our founder's motto. TJ Maxx, teach your kids to drive in our empty parking lot. Oh, Guy doesn't speak much English. He's from Quebec. Engineering, I think. But he is insane, Brian. A legend. Guy, hello. What the hell? Ah, look at him drinking that soda. Classic Guy. Wow. She is the most memorable and endearing baby I've ever seen. Okay, then. <laughs> oh, I'm sorry. Are you, are you almost done? Oh, yeah, no, sorry. I'm just, I'm doing sets. I'm just doing little sets. Oh, cool, cool. Guys, he's doing little sets. Cool. Little cool. sets. Cool, cool. I got you in the opening credits of SNL. Okay, look, here comes Keenan. Oh, look at him playfully hailing a cab. And here you are. Look how cool and hip you look walking by a manhole cover with steam coming out of it. <laughs> that looks like Keenan's still that? trying to wave down a cab. Well, I guess that means I can get rid of all my hot grandma merch. Well, I'll just donate it to Goodwill. You know what guilt means, right? Yeah. God, I love fentanyl. You said it, pal. <sighs> oh, here you go again. Now you're at the club holding up a one more signal for a drink. Why will nobody stop for Keenan? Oh, but Mikey Day gets a cab first try. Oh, he's sharing Damn. it with Keenan. He's sharing it. Okay. Oh, very Damn. stressful opening credits this week. Well, Bruce and Jeffrey, I gotta say, you two have really stepped up to become a couple of great dads. Thank you, Lois. You sound a bit surprised, which seems right for a woman with that haircut, but you're sweet to say so. Yeah, that seems about right for a guy with that haircut. Thank you, Peter. <laughs> Stewie, did you do this? Jeez, Brian, don't just come barging in here like that. I thought you were campus security. Guy pushed an air conditioner off the parking garage yesterday. Almost hit a public safety officer. By the way, that's between us. They're going door to door. It's pretty serious. I don't care about that. I want to know who wrote Renob on my chest while I was sleeping. Renob? <laughs> Ryan, you read that in the mirror. It's boner. What? To help explain the transition to our futuristic workplace, oh, I'd like to share a video shit. from our investor, the confusingly charismatic WeWork lunatic. Hey, I'm the guy from WeWork. My foremost goal is to facilitate an experiential bandwidth of synergy. Hammock desks, scooter desks, and the world's first desk desk. The only desk that functions as a working desk. I have been the WeWork lunatic. Please don't Google me. Weird Easter this year. Yeah, you're back! Oh, we missed you so much! Oh, I missed you guys. Meth was great, but I guess it's bad. I don't know, I'm not really sold on that yet. We're proud of you, Peter. Stewie, you've taken this mini-fridge thing too far. I'm moving this thing out of here. Oh, be careful, Bry. Not a good idea. You don't want to piss off Guy. Yesterday, he crow-hopped a dip tin and knocked a guy out. Oh, wow, did he really? Well, now I'm so very scared of Guy. Oh, ho, ho, Guy! Se fout un grand lancé! Je crois qu'il est mort, eh? Boy, everybody's here. Why do you think we're gathering? This isn't about the soiled pants in the toilet, right? Because I hadn't heard about that. Good morning, employees. As some of you can tell by my face, I have some exciting news. But first, a pair of husky-sized green pants were found in the men's room. Positively destroyed. That's what I hadn't heard about. And why'd you rearrange everything? I just want to find my vitamins. I'm not... Is it warmer or colder? I feel as worthless as any coin smaller than a quarter. Hello. My name is Nickel. Hi, Nickel. There was a time when I paid for a ride on a trolley, or a good cigar, or a hand-cranked film of a man tipping his hat and twirling his mustache. But yesterday, I was part of a handful of change at a McDonald's, and the teenage girl threw us out! Just, just threw us in the trash with the wrappers and the bag, I... Uh, <laughs> Ma'am, don't Damn. worry. This happens all the time. I'm sure you have your receipt. What? No, I don't have a receipt. Okay, then we're just going to go to the office, call your parents, and send you on your way. Daddy, I just... There are going to be some changes around here. First off, no more lipstick. That's how all this trouble started. Coming this fall from Pixar, coins! 
We'll keep making things talk until you don't show up. Peter, don't you see? We gotta make you the hero again. Wait, say that again. We gotta make you the hero again. Yep, yeah, you got weird teeth. Wait, what did you say before about the hero thing? I said we gotta make Peter the hero. All right, he does have weird teeth. I just have to show Lois I can still be her hero. That's exactly what I was saying. Good morning. How much are the muscles? $34 a month at Bally's Total Fitness. Peter, why are you behind the fish counter? I got a promotion. Emphasis on the ocean. Fine. What do you got that's fresh? Well, I got a teenage son at home. What a mouth on that kid. And I'm going to take care of it. Just like I've been taking care of that egg since high school. Oh, my God, I forgot to pick him up from soccer practice. Hey, do you need me to call your yolks? <laughs> Peter, um, surprised he survived. This thing got to the point it looked like he was about to wither away. Oh, man. Man. <laughs> this so skinny. Here. So skinny. I've never seen him like that before. <laughs> Maybe it was meant Yeah, there's that. some other stuff. Yeah. This nigga's tried. He's probably tried every drug. <laughs> and I accuse him of not working. Apparently, yeah, he, he does. He has a lot of jobs. Peter has a lot uh, of jobs. Yeah, I guess, yeah, yeah, random jobs he picks up. Yeah. Yeah, but like Homer has had one job, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, <laughs> that's that's what. Let's well, say Peter. He he works. <laughs> <laughs> he's been. A, I think he was a prostitute at one point too. Like this nigga, he was on the corner. <laughs> he provides for his family. I give him right, that. Right, 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 right. <laughs> and he loves his family. <laughs> Everybody except Meg. But yeah. Yeah, let me saw Meg pregnant. I gotta figure out how she got pregnant. Well, I think she was pregnant for those two uh, dudes. Ah. Uh, she was the, uh, you know, she was the, you know, holding the baby for him. 